Greetings Special Centurions and welcome fellow YouTubers back to Lorim. We have just left the Wiften, um, sorry, Whiterun City, Hold, Castle, whatever you want to call it. We are going to head out and we are going to go hunting. We've got arrows, we've got a good bow, we've got a good sword we can defend ourselves with. We're just not wearing any armour. So if we do get attacked by anything, we're going to have to run away screaming like a little girl. But hopefully we're not going to get attacked by much or anything at all. Hopefully we'll be able to hunt. Who are you? What do you need? Who are you? How's travel these days? It's most of the Hold's fighting men committed to the war. There are fewer swords to keep the road safe from brigands and wild beasts. Doesn't sound good. Do you know any way to deal with giants without killing them? Of course. Them? Oh really? How? It's all in this note. Oh, cool. Read Uric's note. Uh, until next time. Who is this guy? Note on giants. We need... Hang on, wait for the quest writing to disappear. We need the following for the offering. 300 gold, a bucket's worth of blue dye, the poem Ode to the Tundra... Tundra Striders. Tundra Striders. The annual ritual. We approach the chieftain, we present the offering and declare our intentions. We read the verses. Remember to not choose any that might offend. We move away slowly and keep our distance. And remember to speak loudly. They don't hear so good. Okay, so you can leave an offering of a blue cow to the giant and it might take the offering and leave. Um, I don't want to do that because the cow is going to cost 300 which is way more than you'll get for the, um, for the bounty reward. So I'd much rather wait until I'm powerful enough and then just kill the giant, simple as. Is that an orcish shield? Who are you? Speak quickly. Oh, you're a high elf. Ugh. What are your thoughts on the war? How's White Run treating you? Oh, yes, quite fine. My accommodations here continue to be just what I need. What have you got for I've sale? got all sorts of weapons for the discerning marksman. What can I get you? How much are your iron arrows? Don't have any steel arrows. Still, all of it's really expensive. Okay. Alright then. Interesting. There's loads of merchants just sitting around outside here. Which is cool. Uh, right, let's go hunting. Oh, the Khajiit caravan. Whoa, you look awesome. Uh, oh, is that a Khajiit kid or a Khajiit dwarf? I can't tell. Are you a, you a kid or a dwarf? Which one are you? Welcome to you. May your road lead you to warm sand. We are creatures of the desert. The north wind chills us to the bones. I'm curious about you. I want to sell this unusual gem. Will you give me anything for it? No, I don't want to sell it. I uh, hope that you will come to do business with us again. Yeah, I will one day. Let's go poaching, chat. Oh, except it's not poaching because we've got a. Uh, we've bought ourselves a. Um, what's it called? A permit, a hunting permit. Actually, now might be a good time to go to Rifton. Uh, not Rifton, the other place. Keep keep saying Rifton for something. You've got Rifton on the brain. No, uh, to Riverwood. If we go up to Riverwood, we might find stuff to do there. Seeing as that's like the opening segment of the game, there might be quests and things we can do. We might be able to get a follower, that could be handy. Having Feindale joining us for the hunt, for example, could be useful. Because I'm pretty sure one arrow, one bow shot, isn't going to kill a an elk, a fully grown elk. So we need Feindale to uh, take a second shot at it once we've opened fire. And hopefully we'll be able to... Um, take it down that way otherwise it's just going to keep running off and my archery isn't strong enough to kill it quickly enough for it to uh, die in range for us to get its stuff get its meat chat There's an elk. I see a moose chat. 
I see a little silhouette of a moose. Got a moose, got a moose. Whoops. Pow! Like that. That's what I mean. Now she's going to keep running around, like run off, and my archery is not good enough, probably at this point, to take it down. Come back! She's going to be wasting arrows. Got nowhere to go, chat. Except all the way up there. Jeez, it's gone far. Where'd it go? Oh, it's just carrying on. It's just going miles. There's two of them trapped here. Oh my god, look at how much fucking damage it takes. Luckily, it's standing still now. Thank goodness it's trapped and it's got the iron spear in it. It's like a deer in a headlight stuck. And I can't speak when I'm archering properly, apparently. I can't speak at all when I'm archering. Come on, go down. How much does it take? It's just bleeding all over the place. Oh my god, really? It's still alive? Gotcha, you fucker. But you get, you give one XP each, jeez. They only give one XP each, chat. I was hoping we'd get more than that. I hope we can get like five or something, five to ten for each one. Well, that's a good start. But we're never going to level up this way, so let's go to Riverwood, like I said, see if there's any missions we can do in Riverwood to get some XP. Uh, and then we will... I think there's a, a wolf over this way, isn't there? There's usually a wolf here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. I miss. I like the way the animals actually get actually get skinned. That is so cool. It leaves like the skinned corpse behind. That is awesome, chat. It's so cool. Riverwood looks amazing. Look at that water chat. It's like a tropics. You can hear frogs. All kinds of stuff. That's so cool. Is this fish free? It is. book, Line and Lure. Uh, I'm actually going to fish here because I want to see if I can catch, it won't take long first of all, and uh, I want to see if I can catch anything different from what I caught. when I was in Riften. Oh my god, there's a four-legged creature underwater, chat. What is that? Oh, it's a frog. River Betty, okay. But 
Plus, you can actually catch some really good stuff, like the Grand Soul gem I found. With a Grand Soul inside. That was fucking diamond chat. We found shitload. We got shitload of money for that. Cons. Ugh. So much for that. Plus, it's just beautiful here. It's really relaxing, to be honest. Bro, Nan, relax. Feeling good. Leave a Betty again. Nothing but River Betty's. Are you kidding? Give me something good. I suppose we were pretty lucky to have found the mud crab on like the second attempt that we ever fished. That was pretty fortunate. Brook bass. Did we need that? It doesn't look like it. Oops, didn't mean to take the fishing rod, whatever. Oh, we need a glass fish, a goldfish, and a pog fish. That's what we need. Oh, what do we get now? Tongs again. Ugh. I give up. We're getting nothing but River Betty's here. Fuck it. Fuck this place. Let's go and see if there's any work around here. They say the college has been snooping around Sarthal. Mages in a burial crypt. No good. Well met, friend. New to Riverwood? How can I help you? Anything interesting going on around Lucan town? over in the Riverwood Trader says thieves broke into his store. Strange. He says they hardly took anything. We're a small village, but we work hard and take care of our own. Only worry we've got is the war reaching this far. All right then. Huh? All right then. Okay, let's go in. Let's just go into the Riverwood Trader straight away. Pick up the Bleak Falls Barrow mission uh, and see if there's anything well, else going on around here. Fuss has to do something. Whoa, this place I got trapped. No, no adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's Ooh. hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh, <clears throat> a customer. <laughs> Sorry you had to hear that. That's so cool. The place has been trashed. Yeah, well, I don't know what you overheard, but. The Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. Well, by picking things up off the floor, maybe you should clear up a bit. What happened uh, here? Yeah, the, we, we did have a, a bit of a, a break-in. but we, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. I could help you get the claw back. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northwest of town. Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? But not. Fine. But only to the edge of town. Oh, the girls do spawn. The sooner you find the claw, the sooner our lives can get back to normal. We could always use help. course spend six hours cleaning up the shop for him he might be grateful give us a discount there let's 
gets everything cleaned up. Thank you. Here, this is for you. Oh, nice. 81 septums and an iron war axe. Uh, what have you got for sale? Take a look. No, I mean, that is what do I have for sale now? Raw venison, definitely sell the meat, it's really heavy. Mm. Sell all the salmon fillets, sell the brook bass. You want all the rest of this stuff for tanning, making leather once we've leveled up. Okay. That's everything all right here. Then. Yeah, it looks nice. Let's go to the inn. This way. Good talking to you. Uh, okay, I think that glitched, but whatever. That glitched pretty massively. She was supposed to take me to the edge of town, but whatever. Give me some supplies, I think. Steaming Giant Inn. Uh, yeah. Something. Yeah, I need you to get out of my face. Jesus. Right. Orgnar. Orgnar, are you listening? Hard not to. Did you hear me? Yep, ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your air vest. Hmm? So she said, how many? I'm sorry, I lost count at 14. Huh? Who are you? Where's the bard? Welcome. Let me know if you want. Ah, a fisherman. Got Good. Somewhere. What do you mean, good? <laughs> it's so random. Oh, good, you fish from lots of meat from the sea. Camilla. Laura bless you for agreeing to help us. Good luck. Where is the guy who gives you the mission to disrupt Feindel? It's bad. Feindel thinks he can woo Camilla yeah, Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. Well, you're a ventriloquist. Do you know any other... You and Feindel both like the same girl? Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood trader to speak with her when I'm not around. He's wasting his time. He sounds persistent. You may be right. Camilla may see Feindel as little more than a friend, but why take chances? Here, give Camilla this letter. It's full of venomous nonsense. Tell her it's from Feindel. Sure, why not? This ought to be amusing. That letter ought to convince Camilla to never speak to Feindal ever again. Uh, Sven's letter, where is it? Letter from... What? It's not there. Sven's fake letter from Feindal, there it is. That's not really full of venom. He's just like, that makes him an elitist, but it's not really venomous. It's basically saying, I'm superior to you, therefore I cannot marry you. Which is fine. Well, it's not fine, but whatever. Why is my, why am I vibrating? Is there an earthquake going on or something at the moment? Oh, I'm cold, I think. I can only assume I'm cold because for some reason my, um, Keypad, my keypad's going nuts. Oh, not my keypad. My controller's going nuts. It's vibrating. Something fierce. Let's go talk Feindel about Sven's letter. I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? Riverwood's agreeable enough, I suppose, for a Nord village. Yeah. Sven wants me to leave this letter to Camilla saying it was from you. Forget about Camilla, she's with me now. That's so funny. What is that blowhard up to now? So, he thinks he can turn Camilla against me. 
two can play at this. Here, give this letter to Camilla and tell her it's from Sven. Let's see what she thinks of him after reading that. You're both as bad as each other, for God's sake. I don't think either right of you then. deserve Camilla. But I want you on my side, Feindil, because you're a good shot. And I need, I want all this stuff. And once you join me, all this stuff will be mine. So, yeah, we're going to go and do as you ask. Yeah, my controller's still vibrating outside for some reason. Maybe because it's raining. I really don't know. Taking that stuff isn't stealing. But still, taking the stuff isn't stealing. It's just free stuff. It literally is just free stuff out here. That means there might be more free stuff out here. What's this? Iron Warhammer, yep. Iron Sword. Kettle, any free stuff in the barrel? No. No more free stuff. Great has one here. Slow design and roll of paper. Ooh, great. What time is it? It's too late to go to the shop. We've got all this free stuff. Oh, what we'll do is we'll deliver Feindel's... Oh. How much... How heavy are we? Quite a lot. We're 40 over. Where's the nearest barrel? There's a barrel up here. We'll drop some stuff off in there. And then we'll collect Feindel as a follower. <laughs> Salt! Now we can cook the meat. And give him that stuff to carry. Mara bless you for agreeing to help us. Feindel asked me to give you his letter to say it was from Sven. No, I want to do... I want to give you the letter from Sven. Farewell. I don't want to betray Feindel. I want to give. You're a strapping young man. Don't be a stranger. Oh, Ronan, like. No, I want to. Um, where's the other option? I don't want to give Fein. Ask me to give this letter. Give this letter and say it was from Sven. No, I want to do the other opposite. I want to give you Sven's letter. How do you choose the? Um... Oh, it looks like we're not going to be able to get Feindel. Looks like it's bugged. That's annoying. How do you? I'm going to drop Feindel's, uh, Sven's letter from Feindel. Um, I'm so confused. Why is it not letting me do the right way around? Feindel's fake letter from Sven. I want to give that to you as though it's from Sven. Hello, friend. You really ought to choose between Sven it's and It's bad enough my brother is harping on me to pick. I don't want to choose. They're both so amazing. Well, I've got no choice here, so I have to give her this. A what? What are you talking I about? I have to betray Feindel. Why, that jealous idiot. Thought he could just manipulate me into never seeing Sven again? That's thank annoying. you for telling me the truth. You should speak to Sven. I'm sure he'll want to thank you, too, for defending his name. I don't want Sven's help. I want to fucking... I'd better get going. I want Feindel's help. This is bullshit. Days come and gone. That letter ought to convince Camilla to never speak to Feindel ever again. Do you know? Forget about Camilla. I don't think Camilla will be spending any time with Feindel. Maybe it's because I talked to him first. Now that's I what know. I like to hear. Good work. I think you deserve some gold from my tips at the inn. I'd much rather have Feindel as a follower. 
follow me, I need your help. Maybe he'll join me I now. I suppose Master Neloth won't mind. He's always telling me to get out of his way. Okay. We've got Sven. <laughs> what? Why is everyone laughing? Well, we've got Sven as a follower now. That'll do. That's a good start. Does he have a room here that I can loot in that case? That's really annoying. If you help, if you get Feindel's help, get out of the way. If you get Feindel to help, one, not only is he um, a better companion because he's a really good archer, but you can go into his house and loot all the stuff oh, in his house. All that stuff would have been ours, but it, it doesn't let us. Ow. This is just a storeroom. It's not where Sven will sleep. Yeah, for some reason I couldn't um, I couldn't give Camilla the letter and say it was from Sven. I had to give her the letter that from Feindel and tell her it was the wrong tell her the wrong way around basically. So I've got Sven as a follower. Not Feindel, which sucks. Right, let's get this stuff. Right. Let me know if you have anything you need from me. Yes. Uh, whoa, there's a lot. I need to trade some things with you. If it will help you, then certainly. Oh, he's got a healing potion. I'm taking that. Taking that to sell. Taking that to sell. He's got a house. Oh, I'm taking... Oops. Taking all that stuff. Uh, I'm giving you stuff to carry. Stuff that I don't care about. So the shield, helmet, helmet, steel gauntlets, iron boots. Uh, all of these hides. Steel ingots. Oh, the steel ingots are stolen. That's interesting. Okay, we're now underweight. If there's any way I can be of service... Right, where's your house then? I'm never going to find it in the dark. I don't even have a torch. Let's just spend the night here at the inn. Till the... Um, till the shop opens in the morning and then we can sell everything we've picked up. Well, let's see how much it is actually first. Can I get you something? What have you got for sale? May I wait for a carriage in your inn? Heard any rumors? Uh, how? Can I not get a um? Can I not get a room? How do I Come get a room in. here? Just stoke the fire. Take do a I have seat. to talk to you? No, out. you're the. You're not the person I get You're a room that from. visitor been poking around. Oh, I'd like to rent a room. Yeah, there you sure go. Sure thing. One day is 50 gold. Jeez. Uh, there is only sun. Can I get you something? I'll have some wine, please. Tell me right so which room is mine, this one? Yeah. Let's just sleep. It's 9 p.m. Let's sleep until 7, 8.20. Peckish. Uh, let's eat some food in that case. Yeah, let's just eat a cabbage. Nom 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 nom. Cabbage delicious. Bronan love cabbage. Right, let's go out and look for Sven's house. See if we can pilfer a bunch of stuff from Sven's house. Ultimately, I don't really care who I've got as follower, as long as it's someone who um, can carry all the shit that I can't carry. Holding Gerda's house. That's Feindel's. That was where we went for, to see Feindel. Oh, I can't get over this wall. Fucking hell. Um, so where the fuck is Sven's house? Let's look on the map. Sven and Hilda's house. Oh. I didn't know Sven had uh, shared a house with Hilda. That makes being able to steal stuff very unlikely. You can just take everything that's not nailed down here. It's a maze ball. 
Right, this is Sven's house. What's this green bar that's just opened? That, what was that green bar that kept showing up? So we should be able to take all this stuff. No, it doesn't work like that with Sven. Maybe because he shares a house? Yeah, I think because he shares a house with Hilda, you don't get to just take everything. Oh well. Maybe it's because it's the um, mod list as well. Maybe it's um, the mod not letting me take everything. But since we could take everything outside from this guy's house, maybe we can take everything inside as well. No, it's locked. Alright, let's go to the store. Is that Feindel? No, who are you? <laughs> Need something? It's a fine day with you around. Oh, hello, my lady. See you. Sven, you're looking pretty beastly in that stuff. Give it to me. What can I do for you, friend? Give me all that stuff that you've got. Of course. Give me. Actually, no, you can keep the hides. We're just going to sell all the other stuff. Let's get going, then. The sooner you find the claw, the sooner... Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Wolf heart, is that an ingredient? It is, cool. Gonna eat that right now in front of everyone. Just to gross them out and make them think I'm insane. Mm -hmm. I like eating wolf heart. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with that even? Nothing wrong with a little bit of wolf heart. We have a Betty. Wolf heart. <laughs> Whoa, that hurt. That hurt so much health. That probably wasn't a good idea. Well, I got the ingredients from it, I think, but it took... I got the, um... What it does, but it definitely hurt a lot. Oh, look at the little chickies! Little baby chickens, so adorable! Um... So what stone have I got under? I'm just thinking you might go get the stones. See what stone I'm under at the moment. Oh, feds. Leather backpack, amulet of arcade, adrenaline rush. Yeah, I don't have a summoning. I don't have a stone yet, so let's go get the stones while we're here. Oh, wait, we need to speak to Feindel as well and see what he has to say. Whoa, who are you? Oh, it's Ben. I just saw someone charging at me like a prop down the line. Right, let's go. Let's go get one of these stones. Get the uh, stone sign or whatever. Oh, there's a deer over there. I would fuck it up, but it's on the other side of the river. Oh, that's my fishing rod. Nope, insta killed me. The wolf just insta gave me him to jump up and rip my face off. Uh, fucking hilarious. I think it was an ice wolf or something. Uh, I, I remember it spawns you somewhere weird, doesn't it? It doesn't load your save. Let's load the save. 
It just spawns you somewhere random. It just drops you off, dumps your body somewhere. It's like, there you go. You carry on from there. Oh, no. It crashed, chat. God damn it. Oh, well. Let's reload. How are we doing on time? Still got 20 minutes. Okay. That's enough time to reload. It'll take about five minutes to load up. We will carry on from where we were. This time I won't go in first. I'll let Sven go in and take a couple of hits, and then I'll come swing in. Come in swing in, chat. I'm only half health with no armor, so it's probably best to um, let Sven tank for a little while. It may look like nothing's happening, guys, but we are just waiting for Skyrim to load. It just sits there with a blank screen for a little while, and then after like five or ten minutes, it goes bop and pops into life. So just waiting for that. While we're waiting, I want to give a huge shout out to all the new viewers and subs of the channel. Guys, thank you so much for your support. Thank you for being here. It really means the world to me. The channel is growing as much as it is. We've now reached almost one and a half thousand subscribers, which is almost as many subscribers as I have videos produced, which is a whole new record for me. So yeah, that's friggin' awesome, guys. Thank you all so much. I really appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying the content. Be sure to smash that like button if you are having a good time. And if you're new here, consider subscribing. So that you don't miss out on any future content and can stay up to date with the Skyrim lore in series as we go. I will be playing Sky Oblivion as soon as that drops. I will. Oh, here we go. Here comes Skyrim. Lorin. Even I when Sky when Sky Oblivion drops, I will be downloading and playing a full uh, legendary difficulty run on that. Um, because I love Oblivion and we only got about we got barely anywhere. We only did about 30 episodes of it on the channel before it stopped working properly. So I had to quit the run, the uh, playthrough of it, unfortunately.
All right, guys, we are back. Loaded and ready to rock. Now we just need to load the game. Bronan. Red Guard level 267. Load this game. That's how we want to look, chat. That's us in the future. That's how we're going to be one day. Someday soon, I hope to grow up and be a barbarian just like that. But in the meantime, we're going to have to resort to our Skullduggerous, Sneak Snonking, pillaging everything that isn't nailed down and selling it for profit. Dubious ways. Okay, that should be loaded. You should be good. Where's Sven? There's Sven. Should we, we should probably should have given Sven a weapon, actually, instead of taking his weapon away. That may have been an idea. And selling it. Now we're relying on me doing... Why have I got full health suddenly? I don't know why I suddenly got full health, but all right, I'll take it. Oh, I was hoping there'd be a tar there'd be um, arrows in this archery target. Okay, where are them wolves? They were just down here, weren't they? I'm just trying to work out how to block. So that's how you block, but then how do you get out of block mode? So that's not it at all. That's now I'm stuck blocking. Uh, let me just look at the uh, uh, settings controls. Ready sheath. Left hand, right hand, right trigger. So it's not letting me swing now. It's putting in, yeah, it's, it's, it's really weird. I can hear the wolves. It's not letting me swing my weapon at all, chat. Shit. Get him, get him, get him, get him. I can't swing. I can't do anything. I can't even block. I can't block. I can't attack. This is bullshit. I died. Okay, the game's really... Uh, Instead of block, it, it just, I don't know what it's doing, basically.
let it drop me off wherever I am and I'll work out how to attack. Let me know if you want anything. Think I yeah, look how blip, look how bugs it is. Go outside to Riverwood. So now I'm stuck in block mode, and it won't swing or attack or anything like that. But it's not actually blocking either. I don't know what it's doing. Right, there we go. Okay, so it seems to have something to do with this. I don't know what this is, chat. Basically this, when I press right trigger, this pops up, this weird thing on the right. And if I press right trigger whilst I'm holding left trigger. Right, can I attack now? No, it doesn't look like it. What the fuck is this? Right, I can attack again. That's, that's, I'm just gonna leave it at that. No, just done it again. anyone in chat knows what this is, what this fucking circle jerk bullshit is, when I hold left trigger, let me know, because I don't know what it's doing. I can't block, and instead I've got that thing popping up. And then after it goes away, I can't attack. Okay, I can attack again. That'll do. As long as I can attack, I'll just attack. I'll rely on attacking stuff, killing it quickly rather than blocking. And I'll work out what's going on in between. If someone gets back to me about what those fucking circles are, when you press left trigger or for the right hand, I would greatly appreciate it. Otherwise, we might not be able to be a two-hander because we might need a shield in the left hand to be able to bring the shield up to block. Ah, look at my blood stain, chat. Look at my blood stain. Okay, where's that fucking wolf? It's over here. There it is. Ah, oh, the other one munched me. I killed it, but the other one attacked me and killed me at the same time. Ow. <laughs> so one of them's dead.
one of the wolfies is dead. That should just leave just one wolfie left. We really need to get some armor. But Sven is fucking useless. Take all that good stuff. There's an elk there. Drop a save now that we've killed the wolves. Travel across. Oh no, we scared the elk off. I was hoping we'd be able to get across without um, scaring off the elk. The other reason I came across is the, there's a nern root over here. There's a nern root here. Pick up the nern root. Right, let's go get this uh, standing stone. This is easier than fishing. Fucking hell, this is way easier. Just wade into the water and grab them all. Might as well. It's a much easier way of doing it, chat. Look how gorgeous this is. What the fuck is this? Imp there. You can see the imp. Yeah, you're fucking useless, mate. You do nothing but hang... I suppose you've got no armor and weapons or whatever. Still, do something useful, you fucking prick. You're just my carrying bitch. Obviously, you're going to be nothing more than a carrying bitch for us. Okay, cool. There's nothing there. Interesting. Here's the standing stones. Thank goodness. Let's get our standing stone on. Oh, they're not here, chat. Oh, here they are, yeah. Okay, cool. So, the time has come. We've run out of... We've run to the end of the episode, guys. Uh, so, I'm going to end things here for now. In the e next episode, we will pick a stone. Probably be the warrior stone, to be honest. Whoa, I don't like the look of that. And, uh, yeah, we'll carry on from there. Thank you all so much for hanging out today, guys. I hugely appreciate it. I hope you all enjoyed it as much as I've enjoyed playing. I'm going to be back tomorrow morning with another episode of uh, Lorim. I hope you all have a great day, and hopefully I'll see you all tomorrow. If not, I'll try and catch you in some other content I produce. I try and make content every single day now. So, sal, wait till next time.